you know, um, during this ascension, I just really encourage you folks to be alone. And, you know, the reason why this is the case is because um, you have folks that you're unaware of that are attacking your energy. Now, you see, not everybody means it, okay? Um, they don't mean it. It's just you have to understand, like, since, you know, ever since the planet has been programmed into fear, basically what's happening is that they are feeding onto your chakras, okay? They're feeding onto your life source of your balance. They're throwing your balance off. And so you have to be alone so that way you are able to identify what it, who is sending me this psychic parasite, okay? Because you have to understand that during this ascension journey, you have to meditate and you have to identify what the fuck is this energy that's tugging on me, okay? Because what these folks will do is they will try to hide the fact that they're an energy vampire. They will hide it and they will say, oh yeah, I do all this spiritual work. I'm into this stuff. No, but they're actually really energy vampires. Like I said, they don't mean it. Like a lot of folks don't mean it. They really are intuitively trying to do, like they're doing their best. But the thing is that you have to be the judge of it because it's fucking with your energy. It is throwing you off from your ascension. So if you're feeling fear, anxiety, and all these energies, and you want it to stop, you got to be alone to identify who the fuck is, is tugging on your fucking root chakra, okay? And if the higher self tells you what you got to do, you got to do what you got to do. But that's what's going on, folks, is that the reason why a lot of people, they have so much trouble making their final ascension is because they don't understand the importance of boundaries. Folks, you have to have boundaries. You have to stay alone so that way you can identify who the fuck is attacking your energy, who is attacking your root chakra, who is stopping you from ascending and manifesting your, you know, opening your root chakra to manifest love, money. Who is it? Okay? So make sure you folks are playing the healing sessions that I post. Um, I post them like, you know, all the time. I also post on my TikTok, Miss Marie Laveau. But I'm telling you guys, your energy is being attacked. Be alone so that way you can identify who the fuck this person is, okay? Like I said, some folks don't mean it, but I'm telling you. But yeah, check out those healing sessions. They will help open the root chakra so you could stop this fucking crazy bouncy energy that you're going through. I know you guys are going through it, but it's like I said, it's because we need to clear out what the, what the fuck this energy is we need to figure it out and those healing sessions that i post like i said i post if i cannot post on youtube for my healing sessions i'll post them on my tiktok these will help with the jumpy energy